Hello, this is Pete Coors, and uh, I'm joined today with Pat Grant, who's the chairman of Western Stock Show Association, and we're delighted to have Bill Wilson. So, Bill, uh, first of all, how long have you been coming to stock show? Well, a long time. Actually, I think one of the most interesting things, and in, uh, I first got out of college in 64 and 65, we come out here on a boxcar with cattle. That's the way uh, a lot of them came at that time, because it was not the interstates weren't out there yet. So. I think that's an interesting part of my life. It was uh, quite an experience at the time. So basically I've been coming every year, but probably a couple through right after that. But I haven't really stopped down and figured it up. I probably, since 64 to now, probably 95% of them. That's a great uh, a great run and great record. Listen, what you come all the way from Indiana. Uh, what is it about the Western Stock Show Association, the National Western Stock Show that uh, motivates you to be here? Well, first of all, we're in the purebred cattle business. We make our living from that. Uh, so this is kind of, from our perspective, and I think the cattle industry, this, this is a Super Bowl of cattle shows. I mean, it's, if you win something here, it's like winning the Indianapolis 500 race or the World Series ball game or, or whatever. So we like to compete. It's a form of advertising uh, for us is the main reason we come. And then we've got a lot of our clients that buy cattle from us that are interested and that's uh, maintaining and showing them cattle for them out here. So that's uh, just a combination of reasons we come. Uh, it's, it's just, if you're gonna show at the highest level there is, this is it. And, and we're you know, hope to be fortunate enough to win now and then. It's pretty competitive to be out here. And you've had, uh, was it 88? You had uh, you had awards in uh, three different categories. Yeah, in 1988, uh, I was, involved in helping some people with other breeds. We actually had the Grand Champion Bull, uh, three different bulls here that year, the Angus, Charlotte, and Shorthorn. To my knowledge, I don't know if anybody's done that before or after, but it doesn't mean they have it. But this, we got very lucky that year, but we had a really good group of people and, and cattle. We could not have this show without people like Bill Wilson and his uh, his family. What is the key to your success out here? I'd say more than anything, a lot of hard work. Uh, it takes a lot of effort and money to get ready to come to this thing. And, and then another thing my success has been, I've had really a lot of good people help me over the years. We're getting new facilities here in the, over the next course, the next uh, few years. And I just kind of, you know, the heritage and all the legacy of what we have in place and it's going to be disrupted. Do you have any thoughts about that? Well, I, I, I think, you know, I think that people will be patient with you. Uh, you know, that's great you're, you know, went to the effort and put this together and going to try and improve it. So, I mean, I, I think everybody's going to understand that. Uh, I think the legacy will still stay because the legacy is Denver, the stock show, and how competitive it is. So if you're going to be in the purebred cattle business, uh, I don't think whether you interrupted a year or two is going to make a lot of difference. Thanks, Bill, very much. Okay. Thank you,